If you guys have been watching me on Instagram, I'm working on the um, Picnic Time Blanket by Amy Miller, and I adapted this pattern for my knitting machine. I've worked all four squares of the blanket on my machine, I've seamed them all, and I've picked up and knit around the border, and I have to tell you about this border. Uh, Margot Sheehan has generously wrote down on her Ravelry profile page her instructions for this awesome knitted border to this blanket. She's done a bunch of these blankets on her knitting machine and she's pretty much mastered this unique way to do a very um, tidy, cool, knitted, hand knit um, border to the blanket. So that's what I've been working on. So this is the bind off to the hand knit border that she does and it requires a crochet hook. And I've already been working it for a while here. It looks super cool. There's the front and here's the back. I think it's beautiful. And this is how I do it. Pick up a stitch on the right side of your blanket that's in line with the next stitch on your knitting needle. There's your picked up stitch. And then you insert your hook into the first needle, into the first stitch on your needle, and you single crochet through that and then pull it through. The other loops. Pick up a stitch. Where's a stitch? Pick up a stitch and then go over here, single crochet through that and pull it through. And then you keep doing it all the way around your blanket. It is awesome. And it looks like this. This is the front. Isn't that pretty? It's like this wrap around binding and there's the back and um, what else is cool is if you have well when I was putting this on my machine I was weaving in my ends as I went but in hindsight now that I've seen this really cool binding for the border like right here like I won't have to weave that in because my binding will wrap right around it and it'll be hidden so the next time I make one of these, I'm not going to weave in all these ends. Instead, I'm just going to maybe knot them on the side, knowing that when I do this knitted border, this binding will hide all that. It is so cool. Thank you so much to Margo Sheehan for sharing this technique. It's super awesome. I love it. I'll be making more of these.